I plan to put the spark back in our relationship by surprising Vic with a romantic evening. I'm gonna go all out with my full-on body makeover. The typical lady spends hundreds of dollars in the salon doing their hair, their waxing. All right, if you wanna just jump up here, put your head at this end of the table. Okay. But I'm gonna find a way to spend under $100 for my makeover. So I brought my own waxing supplies. So can you make it $30 if I use the strips. Well, we had you booked for the full leg wax, and that's a $65 appointment. You so can't knock you down, down the price. Please. When she walked in, she looked like every other normal person walking in the door. Like, she looks like she can actually afford our services. Ah! get a discount for pain? Oh, I definitely don't think it works like that. Oh! <laughs> so I'm gonna get my hair done, and I brought my weave with me. So these are clip-on extensions, and I'd like you to put them on me. Okay. So I'll just pay the service fee. So is this all the hair that you brought with you? Because it's not gonna be enough for your entire head. I was thinking maybe if you have extra hair laying around, I could use it on my head. Um, the only hair that we would have in the salon right now is stuff that we've taken out of other people's head and we're gonna throw it away. Well, you're gonna throw it anyway, so why not put it on my head? So I'm gonna grab my manager. Um... Unfortunately, we are not able to do that. Um, it is, it's not sanitary for us to do that. But I'm willing to take the risk. Unfortunately, I cannot. We can definitely lower the price for you. We can lower it to 50 from 75. Okay, great. Thank you Thanks, so much. Thanks, Jessica. Have a great one. Bye. Okay. okay. Let's go ahead and get started. I got a little bit of a discount, so it brought it down to $50. Being in the service industry, you definitely come across some crazy people with crazy expectations, but she was by far, like, out there. <laughs> awesome. You well, did a great job. Let's get you out of here. Buying lingerie in the thrift store is a great way to spice things up in the bedroom. Some people think that shopping at a thrift store for lingerie is gross, but, you know, I don't see anything wrong with it. I wonder how many people have worn this thong before, and it looks a little crusty, too. That looks cute. Oh, thanks. <laughs> it's a little big. I see this woman come out of the fitting room in lingerie to each his own. I said, okay, who am I to judge? What in the world? Okay. Oh. <sighs> Honestly, I like that one better than the other one. Would I buy lingerie in a, in a thrift store? Depending on, no, I wouldn't, sorry. <laughs> I wouldn't buy it. I really like this one. I love that one. Oh, yeah. That one's cute. Isn't it? I think that's the best one you've had on. That's really pretty. Yeah, I would take that one. How much is this? The tag's on the back, actually. Oh, I'm okay. not sure. Sure. $2.99? $2.99 is a little out of my price range. So oh, okay. let's say this is really nice. Oh, it's $3.99. OK. So if I get two of these, if I buy both, would you lower down the price for me? I mean, we, re we really don't do that, but I mean, I guess I could give you like a dollar off coupon or something if that would work. Dollar off? The haggling? Holy crap. I, I wouldn't have gone there. I don't think people should go into thrift stores looking for a bargain and asking for more. This so teddy I think it's a pretty good deal. and the robe will save yeah. my marriage. <laughs> well, if it's going to save I'm your marriage, uh, I'll give you $2 off. Hi, how are you? So what are you looking for? Um, well, I'm actually going to have like a romantic night in with my husband. Ooh. So I want to get dolled up 
and I was looking for a few samples of some, you know, like lip gloss or lipstick or eyeshadow or blush. Well, we've got some lip gloss here. Oh yeah, this is really cute. Let's see. Okay, I think I really like this color and I'll put it over um, red lip, this red lipstick that I have at home. Mm -hmm. So how much is this? Those are $22. $22? Okay, that's a little bit steep for my budget. So, hmm. It's worth it, I have that one and I love it. My budget is actually $7 for lip gloss. Afraid I can't help you then. Can you make it, mm -mm, how about $8? Wish I could haggle with you, but it is what it is. Thought it was a little awkward to try to bargain in this kind of store. We don't really do bargaining. I mean, we do have some free samples of perfume at the front if you'd like those. We have these cute little, so these are free samples that you could have. We don't have any lipstick samples. Do you want the perfume? I do, yeah, everything. Okay. okay. As long as it's free, I'm there. Oh yeah, they're free. I did get this amazing free um, perfume, Honey Blossom. I'm gonna use it tonight, I'm so excited. She's a nice girl, but she comes in here all the time. She never wants to buy anything. It's like, we'll give you a free sample, but it'd be nice if you would buy something from our store every once in a while. With $5 spent on secondhand lingerie, Apple's total cost for her makeover comes to $85, well under her $100 budget. I'm gonna remind him why we got married in the first place. Hi, Hi. honey. How you doing? Good. What's going on? What do you think? <laughs> I planned a special night for us. You never do this. I like your hair, it's a little different. Yeah, there's some extensions in there. Some are actually falling off, so let me clip it back on. 